Okay, now I will show you in this tutorial how to customize your search groups. To the tool web be, uh, behind the web, uh, when you go to their website, has many groups that you can search with, and this is very useful. However, sometimes you might want to just limit the search to your own groups because you don't want to have to scroll through all these things. For example, I may not, I may want to do a search as, regarding a scientific matter which does not involve shopping in Walmart. So I will now show you how to customize my own groups. I go to More, and under More, I can have I can designate how many groups I want. So this, where it says here number of groups on your page, I'm going to put four. So I'm going to want my search to be Google, Yahoo. I'm going to put Wikipedia here and video here. The groups will be displayed in the same order as you have it here. I now go to press save change and now it will save the change. And now I'm ready to run my search. So I go back and I press search. So now the two tool web behind the web website is only limited to four groups, the four groups which I designated. So now I want to run my search. I want to search on the H5N1 flu virus. So I will go ahead and do this, I'll write this down, H5N1 flu. And I'm going to want to search, the search to give me what Google has, if I was to just search in Google. I also want Google Scholar. and books and I would like to have Wikipedia give, explain to me about H5N1 and YouTube video so I selected now one two three four five oh and I also want PubMed to give me its results so PubMed, NCBI, NIH I select that. So there are six uh, searches that I will run concurrently. I go ahead and I press go. So now you will notice that we have opening up one, two, three, four, five, six tabs aside from the original till two tab which we ran the search on. First tab is Google, the general Google search. Second one is Google Books. Third one is Google Scholar. Fourth one is the YouTube videos about uh, the flu. Wikipedia. And PubMed's uh, results. In PubMed, you can go and you see that there are 1,649 biomedical literature, literature citations and abstracts. There are also chemical compounds that appear. If I click on this, you can see there are chemical compounds that appear when the search of H5N1 flu is entered in. And so now you can see how I get all at once the results of uh, the search in several website sites. I don't have to search each website individually. To clear the search, I just press here, and as you can see, all the tabs disappeared, only leaving me with the first uh, tab of Tiltool. If I want to go back to the default settings of all the groups, I go back to More, I go to Default, this gives me the default groups, I press Save Change. And go back to search and now we're back to where we started with with all the groups you can add your own groups over here um, there's many more groups that you can add